Hey guys, welcome to Excel Rule Channel again, and another episode of Lookup Function and Formula in Excel. So we have covered the lookup basics and to advance index match offset function, all these function. But I wanted to create a video on key sensitivity part, which you're gonna follow in coming minutes. If you haven't subscribed to this channel, please do it because we are going to cover each and every functionality of Excel in this channel. So let's get started. So suppose we have a data like this here which we have used in the previous example so what we are going to learn here is see by default the vlookup function which is the very popular function performs a case insensitive lookup but you can use helper function to perform a case sensitive lookup i know it may sounds a bit complex but let me give you an example here so we have a full name rodri here but we also have a two types of rotaries in our worksheet which is one rotary goeza and we have another one rotary lovela and we want to find email of this particular student so traditionally how we calculate that traditionally we would use vlookup right and looking up the value like this let me just create a absolute reference in table here let me just create a absolute reference again and we wanted to find the third column here third column here like this and we want if we want the exact match let's just put it as false see if we get or not no we didn't get because by default the vlookup function performs a case insensitive lookup so it just revert back our first rotary as vlookup also come serves first come first basis so it just revert back to us like this see if we do a partial match does this give yes it does give but it won't be a effective solution in the long term okay because if you have multiple rotary value and you may have multiple values with case sensitive or insensitive but it doesn't perform well with this so what i mean to say you cannot rely on approximate match in vlookup for this scenario so yes we got lucky now but if you want to enter a full proof formula so here how you how you should follow so what we are what we going to do is we first we will use exact function to match the exact value of this in this cell so what we going to do is we going to enter the exact function here value is this let me just put it like that absolute and this put it like that absolute and click close so it just revert back as false 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 and true so we got the last value as true so now we will use match function to find the position of true value as we have used the match function previously in index match where we used to find the position of columns and rows in excel so that's how you use this function in exact so so lookup value will be true let me just put it like that true so we just want true value or we can say we just want to find position of true value in this formula and so lookup value will be this because we want to find exactly value of rotary here and just close the parenthesis let's see if we get the answer yes we get the answer this is the 13th value in that cell so what now we have left with we have left with to find the exact email of student name with all caps rotary so to do that we have used index function previously and we are going to use that same here so if you haven't watched the index match video you should do that because in that video we have covered in detail how it competes with popular function like vlookup and you can also perform much more calculation using that index and match function so the combination of index match is very powerful so let me just enter index here so in the index part first array we are going to enter here because we want to get email here so let me just give it a absolute reference here so in the next row number will be this particular formula we have entered right and in the last part we just select zero here just close it down let's see if it gives us a desired value or not so yes it gives us the desired value 
so hope you understand how to utilize these helper function to find case sensitive lookup in excel if you found this video helpful you can click on the like button if you want to share it to your friend colleague you can also share it and if you want to learn more about excel and its functionality please click on the subscribe button because you are missing out on many videos so see you in the next video until then bye bye